A technique that I find useful and that I teach my patients in my first consultation with them is called the rice test. And it's a really easy thing that you can do at home that helps you see straight away what different volumes look like on your body. And that's really the important thing is how these implants look like on you. So the rice test is, um, is exactly that. And there's a couple of important things that you need to do to, when you're doing the rice test. First of all is to get a cheap little plastic bag like this from the grocery store. I don't want a thick Ziploc. You really want a cheap um, fruit and vegetable bag like that. And then you measure with a measuring cup like this, some rice. And start with something like 250 milliliters um, and then go up in 50 milli milliliter increments until you, um, you get to a volume which seems right for you. So you put the rice in the bag, you take the air out of the bag mostly and you put a little knot in the top so that you can move the rice around. And then you want to make this thing into a little hamburger, like that. And then you just tuck it in your bra. How are you doing? <laughs> Good? Good. You ready? And then spread the rice out so that it really covers your, covers your breast and shape it into a circle. And sort of that, that was a 250 milliliter bag of rice. Do you want to turn towards the camera? And that gives a rough idea of how much, vol how much that volume is going to look like on her body. And then you can increase and put another one in that's a little bit bigger and see the difference. Voila. I'm going to have a look. So you can really quickly get an idea of what volume looks good on your body and what you feel comfortable with with this technique at home. And I always I tell my patients to wander around with their rice bags for a few hours, have a glass of wine, invite some friends over, get an idea of how you feel with this rice. Because you really need to have it feel like it's part of your body, that it's the way that you know you want to see yourself and the way that you were meant to be. Try on different outfits, try on your bathing suits, try on your favorite clothes. And you really want to choose the volume that feels most comfortable for you um, without making you feel shy or embarrassed. That's that's the right volume to choose. If ever a woman has a regret, she normally regrets not choosing just a little bit bigger than, than she did. If she was between two sizes, um, it's best to choose the largest size that you feel comfortable with. So that's the rice test. Give it a try. Um, and when you go to your first consultation with your plastic surgeon, you can at least come in with an idea of a range of volumes that you think you, you want to have and that feel, that feel good on your body. Um, and your surgeon can take that information and, uh, and help guide you on the exact dimensions of the implant that will be, uh, be able to help you achieve that result. Mm -hmm.